was her question. What is happening in Arcadia Bay? Time travel. Please feel free to call in and let me know what your experience has been. What you think this might be is this global warming. What is causing all of this crazy weather? Yeah, sure. Okay. Spill, spill, spill. <coughs> You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. <coughs> In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Nathan's in this place? Anyway, I'm gonna just leave that there. Nathan, are you in here? You are in here. Cuff. There it she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Yeah, Thanks, thank you. Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Wow, that's a lot of uh, options here. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but... He's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. I almost feel sorry for him. Hey. What can I do for you, Max? <laughs> You've got more options in here. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. And you for helping her. That's the kind of school spirit we need more of. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. And finally, Nathan Prescott. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Why does that give me options? Does this tell me about my options? No, it does not. How does that help me? Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look, Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you tweed bitch. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Your sugar daddy will always protect you and threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe I could help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. Holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. 
Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Frank, Nathan, or off what? Why? Holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. <sighs> Holy shit, what do you want now? I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Great. So, if I talk to you, are there any other options? We'll chat later, Max. If I talk to you, are there any other options? I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. Buy drugs, leave. Leave. <coughs> I don't want to go that way. Come on, faster! I've got a lot of information, so I want to know what happens when I talk to them all over again. Hey, Copper. What dialogue has changed? There for she you? is, Supermax. Thanks, Officer Barry. I'm glad. Oh, things has changed. Prescott deal. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? <laughs> I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Sweet. What can I do I for got you, Max? more information. Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. Now, to his credit, he had a revelation, and he saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? Information galore! What can I do for you, Max? I don't know, is there anything else I can... I can oh, I feel mind. like Dave... Not for long. He's eager... That's true. Maybe what can I do for you, Max? To you, I suppose. Actually... my time how much information does that give me on you right now there she is yeah. thanks officer I'm glad Prescott deal again well I heard a rumor you were working for Jesus 
I don't blame. Look, some. Okay, never mind. What can I do for you, Max? Don't know. Just. I feel like. D I want Not to cover all my bases by going through the dialogue again. He's Just skip it. That's skip, true. Skip, skip. Just want to make sure I, I do have you, all my bases covered. Do you? And last and not I least, Kate Marsh. And okay, I've exhausted the cop. Now it's time to exhaust Nathan. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh look, Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you tweet. Yeah, whatever. Cops information. I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. <laughs> Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Get a lot of dialogue. Fucking stupid. Get out of my space. Damn, I really pissed him off. Shut up. I need to go back. Rachel. Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh, I'm spending so much oh, time look, in this Max diner. Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Shut up. Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you. If I can skip. Blood oath? Fuck me. Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Thanks for the information. Holy shit. Anything else you want to tell me? Did that restart? Holy shit. No, I didn't. Come on, come on, faster. All right, anything else you want to tell me? Rachel, uh, whatever the fuck. Uh, oh look. Mm, no, okay. Well, let's just cover all my Morgan. bases. Hope. Actually, you know what? Fuck it, I don't care. <sighs> Alright, I am loaded with so much dialogue! Finally, I get to do you right now. You show up after- <laughs> Shut up. You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh how, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here, judge for yourself. Looks great. I can't just take it right in front of him, can I? Am I supposed to do something here? I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. <laughs> you did not just do that. <laughs> what the Give fuck? me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. <laughs> really? You just let me do that. He brought. Now back to Chloe. Well, I suppose that was... <laughs> I 
<laughs> I forgot I, I keep the items I take. Quite literally. Yeah, sure, I'm I'm leaving. First I missed this one. I am not happy about that. I know I missed it. Are you shitting me? Nope, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go that way. Kidding me? Really? Alyssa, watch out! Quick thinking, Max. <laughs> hey, how's Ooh, it going? That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. Yep. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. You've paid your dues by saving Kate's life on the roof. You really are a Blackwell hero, Max. Kate's my friend. I'm just glad she came down. Kate's a good person. My friend. And she was almost bullied to death by a video. It's fucked up. But you're an amazing friend. I want to make sure she knows how many friends she really has from now on. Amen to that. Good. Max, we should get a posse to see her in the hospital when they allow visitors. Fuck yeah. Well, let's hang later and talk some more. Absolutely. I'm still kind of searching for another bird and a tire. I'm just hoping I didn't actually miss it. Otherwise, I'm going to be very unhappy about it. Another bird. What is going on here? Birds are dying. That's what's going on. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals? Holy shit. Yeah, no shit. Fuck. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. Thanks! On your mark, get set. Throw! Why would I throw it towards the road? I'm not a monster. Get the treat, treat boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. Although killing the dog is uh... The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Yeah, hopefully it doesn't, cause we're busy. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Whatever you say. Oh, Just... we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. All right, what? Where next? Okay, never mind. Just let me do my thing, I suppose. You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. Yeah, so basically Sit, do nothing. Not a, nothing. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. I'm gonna sneeze. I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. The archetypal filthy guy dishes. <laughs> Ah, oh, bless me. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. Oh yeah, it's his home, basically. Crappy wife. 
Frank must spend all Sorry. his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Yeah, that was still looking for stuff. How can somebody live like this? He's a dealer. What do you expect? Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? Exactly, both. Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Who knows what that means? Right Whoa, now, it doesn't what the hell matter. Is he doing with that dog? <sighs> Stop it! Is Frank going to deal online now? I wouldn't be surprised. Low torch. That's a pretty extreme lighter. It's for doing drugs. Obviously. Vent. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Almost cute, yes. Two fence. Open. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Do you though? <coughs> Ooh, Frank's stash. Not gonna tamper with it? For fun? I could pry this vent open with the right tool. Yeah, like a knife. And there's two fence, so... Take my pick. This is almost as good as a set of keys. Yeah, sure. Whatever you say. Let's get a move on then, shall we? Open up the first one. Uh, you broke it. Nothing here. My blade will open any portal. Yeah, sure will. Take it. Don't just stand there. Don't let me hold your hand all the time. Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. Rachel and Frank's dog. Interesting. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Probably a bit of both. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. She looks Rachel pretty. really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. <laughs> hmm. Trouble in paradise. Yeah, not surprised. Now we have a book. Can we return a knife? Having that knife on us is probably not a good thing. I cannot believe you would wear a collar and a furry mask. What did you find? I'm still not happy I missed this one. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on a stepfucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Good lord. And there goes his key. <laughs> Causing an accident, I see. Are you going back to your house? Because I really want to get that photo. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. Grow up! God, you're not the only one in Arcadia Bay with problems. Kate Marsh almost... Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? 
That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame David? I said my dad. My real father, who got himself killed for nothing. Not the human placeholder for Joyce. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. I thought she was going to slam on the brakes and tell me to get the fuck out. Don't take me back here. I need my picture of the bird. Take me back to your house. To where I need to be right now. God fucking damn it. This is where we go back in time because one of the photos that I need is something in the past. Oh my god. What is happening now? Something new. Fucking new. I called it based on the fucking book with the photos missing. Uh, use AD keys and left mouse button, right mouse button to, until you find the sweet spot. we go someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers I hope the flash didn't scare you Max this is a keeper not until I see it first you know the rules dad Max tell him whoa hey you look totally pale are you okay yeah I just uh yeah I'm fine okay Chloe give me the thumbs up or thumbs down oh. I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is and here. Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back, back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them crickets. I'm 18 years I'm old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat How? We. I volunteer to break the eggs. <laughs> you, you remember how travel many Travel through time. Mom said it depends. That's true. Oh, one thing's missing. Okay, this is them. I knew it. Can I still get this one? So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? Camera, gimme. I am. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. You got Just it. Just make me look young. No, don't put the camera down. That defeats the purpose. Away? Fuck. I'll let her know that. You can see the bond between Chloe and her father. And the love. Now this is a f Oh, shut up. So I did miss one. Fuck you. And a bag oh, of no. potatoes. 
God damn it, what am I doing here then? I am not happy. I want to go back and take that one. Load up. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> Well, let's rewind this all the way back. What? What? I'll let her know that. So where are your keys then, huh? If I hide your keys, you can't do shit, right? What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Yeah, yeah. Find his keys. Oh, I should have let him find them for me, shouldn't I? Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, Hurry I'll come up, pick you up. Find your keys. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Yes, keys, please. Find your keys. Aha! Under your hats. That's far enough. Please. Isn't it? No? So what, was it too far? I'll let her know that. Really? His keys are right there and he won't let me take it? Am I supposed to let him go further? Fuck you. Oh yeah, I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Hurry up. Get your keys already. Come on. Hello. Hey honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe. Come and on! Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Hurry up, will you? Does that say cunts? No, it says brunts. Aha! You can't hide from me forever! Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much. Well, now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Either Score! Go. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Daddy dearest won't Shit, die where now. where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. You ain't going anywhere, my dude. The Shit, future is about keys? to change. Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Really? I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And really? no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. 
Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me! That makes all of us. <laughs> yeah, sure. I have to try. I have to. I, I was put here to use this power to save William. Where are you, though? For Chloe. Queen at the Save Mart. She don't. Right. I have your keys, so I should have plenty of time to hide these. Right? Alright, where can I put them though? Waste paper bin, not good enough. Hold up a minute. I'll let her know that. Unplug. Boom. Disconnected. God damn. Really? Fuck! Where's your goddamn phone? It's in your pocket. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work. I'll let her know that. Pull up. Okay, now try and find your keys. Oh. Here, here it is. We saved her father? I know I had those keys Probably right here. Probably for the I worst. Know it. Forgot all always... about you, little buddy. Release the keys. There's always karma. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and joys and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so oh. fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. And this has caused an absolute clusterfuck. His death didn't happen. That just erased everything that we just did. All the hate, the change, the trouble. Ah, uh, this is this is not gonna go well, is it? I have bad feelings all over me. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Really wet and cold every day. But Never like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so long. I know, sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girl's potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Birdie even recognized you too by the looks of it. Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? A lot. Chloe. He's a bus driver. Chloe, you 
okay? How much has changed? Everything we've done is just gone. The outside doesn't look any better either. The birds are still going crazy, it still looks grey and dark. Why are you playing happy music? There's nothing to be happy about. That's a big whale. That's a lot of big whales. Max Caulfield, taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. Hi. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. of your decision. God fucking damn. That was episode three. Everything we've done, gone. Ow. And I bet the game is gonna make us undo what we just did as well. Isn't it? She's in a wheelchair. I'll see you guys in episode 4. Bye.